Good morning! Welcome back to Leo's Playground. Flying in and saying hello. Let's start off by taking off my glider. Don't forget to hit that like and that subscribe button. In today's episode, we are going to be having some fun. But first, my name is Leo the Leopard. And welcome to Minecraft Let's Play videos at Leo's Playground. Today, hello Mr. Dolphin. We are going to be having a fun time. Uh, I'm pretty excited about today. We are, is Mr. Gecko still here? I think he is. We are, whoops, I just fell down the stairs, didn't I? We're going to be playing, I guess we are playing with these. Um, we are going to be uh, playing Pac-Man. We got it finally built, and there's a lot of doors down here. Um, and we're going to play Pac-Man. So I think if we go to my roof real quick before we go see the kitty cats, you should be able to see it right over there way over there is pac-man the game with our pig that's still in the train uh we're gonna go see the pac-man uh game we're gonna play it i'll explain the rules to you hello mr gecko i see that um that was kind of scary i thought we had tnt going off a little blue interesting television there all right so what we're gonna do now is we're gonna get some fish food here uh, I don't know what's going on right now. Uh, let's put the TNT there so we can get it out of the way and get it hidden. And let's count. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It looks like every time we push the button, the door opens up. All right. Okay, so what we're going to go do now is we're going to try to open up all these doors. And we're going to go outside. Mr. Gecko is running ahead of me. And we're going to see what the word of the day is. All right. Word of the day. Let's see. Let's just do it right here because it still looks like it's a little crazy over there. All right. The word of the day is park. We're going to go to the park. So it's P-A-R-K. Park. All right. So let's put that back and let's head to the park, I guess. Or in our case, let's go see the kitty cats. Uh, we haven't taken the train in a while. We'll take the train later on. Let's just go see the kitties. We left Miss Kitty over by the uh, Pac-Man game earlier. But, oh, looks like you made your way back. Well, there you go, Miss Kitty. And who else is in here? Oh, everyone's back. The gang is here. Let's go see if the other four are in the other house. All right, let's go. And it looks like we have a cart going with no one in it. Um, and what we're going to do is we're going to see if Mr. Gecko and Mr. Dolphin can uh, meet us at the Pac-Man game. And then I'll explain the rules to them. And, oh, oh, hello. There's Maisie and Buddy and Daisy and White Baby. Wow, they're all here. That's kind of cool. So we'll leave that door open. Hello, Mr. Gecko, you want to follow me? We're going to head to the park uh, Pac-Man game and we're going to play some Pac-Man. So what we're going to do is, this is going to take a few minutes to get everyone situated and, ooh, turn this way. Uh, the rules are pretty simple. You can't break any blocks. Uh, you have to kill in order to um, win, and you're only allowed to do it three times, and then you have to switch to the next person. And so what we're going to do is, is, ah, perfect, you got your zombie. So the bag people, which are the ghosts usually in... Um, uh, let me see here. What if I can do this? Let me show you guys real quickly here what we got going on here. I'm going to show you guys what this looks like. And let me take a little trip up to La La Land up here. You can see it's all full yellow, little yellow. Oh, I'm falling off. Okay, Mr. Dolphin or Mr. Gecko. Let's, let me go up there and look at that real quick. That knocked me off, please. Okay, so... What we got going on here then is if we go up to the top here, you can see it. Let's go a little bit more. Um, you can see that all these yellow uh, colors, and those are going to be the uh, wool, which are really the, like the yellow dots in Pac-Man. And what we're going to do is you're going to basically um, have to cut all those up in order to win. Um, and then we got to use these shears in order to cut them. So that's what we're going to do with that. Now, here's the catch, though. We're going to have zombies, and zombies are going to be the ghost. And then let's see what we're going to do is we're going to change our skin. 
can use a yellow Power Ranger. What we're going to do is we're going to use this Power Ranger that I found. That's yellow. We're going to use him for now. Um, and then we're going to use zombies or... Uh, yeah, zombies. So make sure all of our characters are in zombies. Please not uh, creepers, because that's too creepy. Um, and then that little black spot down there with the blue, we're going to go down there real quick. We'll show you that's where we're going to respond every time. So let's go ahead and let's bring our tools back. And let's break down. Um, I'm not sure why this is here. But whoever's up there, can you break down the sand for me, please? I think that's Mr. Gecko. Or Mr. Dolphin, can you break down the sand for me? And we're going to go ahead and we are going to show you exactly... Um, let's put this stuff back in the bucket. And let's go ahead and just break this down for them. Okay, so now you guys follow in here. And in order for... The, in order, Please don't. In order for us to kill... Well, we have to be in... They're just being really crazy today. Uh, Mr. Gecko, hold on a second, will you please? All right, head into the uh, area, guys, for me. I'm going to remove this stuff here so we don't use it by accident. And come on in with me, guys. We're going to go into the area. And we're going to run all the way in without breaking anything. And this here is going to be our area that we respawn in every time. So when you guys get here... Okay, Mr. Dolphin and Mr. Gecko are here. Welcome back. We are still here. Uh, they finally came in. I'm glad there was a little fight in there. Okay, so here's the the deal. Um, okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to do this. Since I'm the Power Ranger and there are the zombies, let me explain real quick here what's going on. Uh, certain parts of the map, there are chests. Um, and then I reach those chests. I can get a golden apple and a sword, and I can attack the zombies. Now, I only have the golden apple and the sword for a certain amount of time. And that's only for one minute. I can chase them one. Um, after that, um, I go right back to losing, the, losing the, the sword and the chest. So, I'm not the chest, the golden apple. Also, um, we have the... Uh, in the side, give me one second here. Let me show you. We have over here, if you guys want to, one second, stay there for a second. There are two of these. They're drop down little tunnels. Uh, and we have basically, they are, um, you run from one side to the other. So that's part of the game. So those are right there are little, not safe points, but they, you can kind of get away from them, zombies. Now, if a zombie kills me, I have three chances. After three turns, my game's over, and we'll switch, and we'll go to player number two, which would be Mr. Gecko or Mr. Dolphin. Are you guys ready? Okay, I'm going to go to the front, and Mr. Dolphin was slain already. Okay. And Mr. Gecko, you're ready. Mr. Dolphin, I'm hoping you're ready. And we're going to start in five, four, three, two... One, go. And my goal is, is to get away and get as many of these yellow ones and find a chest. And hopefully, um, not have to worry about getting eaten or destroyed. And if I do come across them, I can go ahead and... Use my sword, if I have a sword. And attack them. But right now, what my goal is, is to hide and get as many of these wolves I can and see if I can win without them finding me. And if I do kill them, bonus for me. And if I get hit, I can turn around and I can say, I can yell out, I'm using my sword! And that gives me one minute of attacking. Oh, there it is. I'm using my sword! And I got one. Oh, and I died! Okay, that's my first time. As a matter of fact, um, that was my first one. Okay, so I used my sword, and I just lost my sword. Now, for, So now my sword is gone. So they, they are going around, and we'll put my sword over here. 
And uh, we're going to go to the next spot. And I lost my other apple. And I have one sword left and one apple. And so here we go in four, three, two, one. And we're going. And this is my second turn. And we are trying now, I am anyways, uh, to make it out of here. Kind of hi hiding, if I am, to make it to the next uh, area. So we don't get attacked again. And see how many of these blocks I can take out. And there we go. Okay. We're doing pretty well so far. It looks like I'm doing awesome. No zombies yet, which are a little ghost technically, I guess. Whew, it's kind of, it's a little scary, it's a little nerve-wracking that it's, that this is, I feel like I'm being followed behind, but I'm not. Maybe I am, I don't know. Uh, it's just, I'm using my sword! Okay, time's ticking for my sword now. I got less than a minute to use it. So... Now they can't leave their ch they can't leave their area until my time is up. I hope they know that. Oh, I died. So after you respawn and after you go back to your hole, you can't leave until my time is up. So that means that sword is gone. Let's put that sword in there for now. Um, and then we're gonna go over here. Okay, what we got next? Okay, so. There we go. Okay. We're doing pretty good here. Okay, three, two, one, and we're going. Use my sword. Got him. Use my sword. So I got one minute. One minute if you guys are dying, you cannot leave your post. One minute. I get to run around, and you guys have to stay in your cage until I say times is up. Because I have this, these powers, 40 seconds, uh, 33 seconds, 29 seconds. You got to be in your cage, Mr. Gecko or Mr. Dolphin, whoever that is. I have 22 seconds. And my goal is 15 seconds to be in my cage, or in your cage, the little ghost area. I have 10 seconds, and then you can leave. Four, three, two, one. You guys can now step out. And if I see him again, I can destroy him again. And attack him again. And I'm using my sword. I got one minute. One minute. Nope, nope. One minute. I've got one minute to destroy you. One minute. You guys got to stay in your cage. Fifty seconds. Did I get them all? So I don't even know if I got them all until you run around and you... You have to... Oops, I missed some right here. Oh, we... Uh oh. 30 seconds. I've got 30 seconds. And 21 seconds. Fourteen seconds. Seven seconds. Four, three, two, one. Now you can come after me. Uh, 
using it. I'm using it. And I got it again. You're not allowed to put more back. Okay, I've got one minute to use this all up, so you have to stay in again. I think that's my last one, matter of fact. I'll have to check, but that's four of them. There might be six, come to think of it. And I think I've collected all the wool. Nope. Yep, I've collected all the wool. Oh, I got Mr. Gecko that time. And Mr. Dolphin. <laughs> All right, <laughs> Mr. Dolphin again. And I have 24 seconds left, and I can't find any more wool. That means that I think this game is done, and I think I've won. Nice job, Mr. Dolphin, trying to get me on that one. I'm double-checking all of my spots. You guys want to head out? Let's go and let's talk about this. If you guys enjoyed this, please leave it, leave your comments and your and your and your uh your hi guys. Oh, you guys are really oh, you guys are playing, huh? Oh, I took out Mr. Gecko. I took out Mr. Dolphin. Okay. What they don't realize is, is I have. Lots of gold. All right, so in the next episode, we're going to play this game again. Um, I'm looking forward to this game. We have, we, I only used one shear. All right, so what we're going to do now is we're going to clean this all up real quick here. Let's go ahead and remove everything. Oh, we have enough room. Look at that, just enough room. And I'm going to get out of my costume here, though, real quick. Because I'm looking really funny in this Power Ranger outfit. <laughs> Hello! All right, so what we're going to do is I'm going to get out of this costume real quick here. If you guys want to get out of your costumes, and you guys can, let's see here. Where is the costumes at? I don't even know where I'm at right now. Change skins. Let me go to my my favorite skins. Let's put my, my, my Leo back on. Um, and then I'm going to go over to the kitty house, and I'm going to grab some milk so I can get rid of all this special abilities. Real quick, I know they'll let me borrow some of their milk. I know they have some somewhere. Let's see here. All right, let's jog this. I know this kitty house doesn't have any yet. You guys will have some soon. The, the milk truck man hasn't come yet. And let's go to this kitty house. As we jump on, we hop and we hop. Is that a is that a cake? No, nope, that wasn't a cake. That was rhubarb. There's rhubarb in our. Hello, kitties. Hello, Miss Kitty. Okay. What a bro. Okay, let's go ahead and get a glass of milk here. Let's finish this milk off. Okay, let's go ahead and take this milk carton downstairs. And what we're going to do is we're going to leave it at our place. And we will finish this up. I can't, I can't even run today, can I? And we are going to dippity doppity hoppity hip. And hello, mister. <laughs> he was being really silly. Frosty guy. And we got to get these doors are here. We can put this right in here with this other one and step over on our step. What a great day it was, everyone. It was beautiful and sunny out as always. Thank you for watching. Let's go ahead and put on my glider. Don't forget that like and that subscribe button. Until next time, have a great day.